Number 10 youth one-stop shop manager Jocelyn Johnston is heading on a road trip this summer and an unusual one at that. The Southland woman will lead a motorcycle tour from Auckland to Invercargill dubbed middle-aged youth workers on bikes. In January, along with co-worker Ruth McLaughlin, she'll make an eight-day journey south, stopping along the way to collect and share the stories of youths and to also celebrate the success of youth one-stop shops around the country. She wants to use social media and talk in the way young people talk while telling their stories, but says it'll be something everyone can learn from. Um, I hope that they'll be picked up at all levels, so I hope that young people themselves will hear the stories um, and that will really inspire them um, through our, like our Facebook page and through magazines and through the paper with opportunities. But I also think there's a need for um, those of people my age to hear the story. We hear a lot about troubled youth, we hear a lot of government departments talk about outcomes for young people, but it seems to me in talking with people that are in my um, age group that they have little understanding about what does the turnaround journey look like? What needs to happen? Who's involved? What is the best way to turn around youth that have had lots of challenges in their lives? So when you say turn around youth, can you explain what you're actually meaning there? Okay, so what I'm talking about is youth that have had lots of challenges. So we live in a country where lots of our young people have had lots of experiences of neglect and abuse and a lack of time spent with them and they see themselves as really, fairly, uh, crappy in their words um, and not worth anything and so it's about their experience of somebody believing in them and them being able to make some healthier choices and come out the other side as independent young people that are well and become leaders and I think that's what we all want. <laughs> now what kind of response have you had uh, so far? Um, it's, it's growing really. Um, the Yosses have really picked it up and said yep this is a youthy type idea let's go for it and so I'm um, still liaising but most people have got something set in place for some young people and some people are really planning their events as to what that's going to look like now. Are you wanting this to become an annual event? Uh, there's been talk about it so it's possible. I haven't really, I haven't had the energy and time to quite think about that. Um, it was just an idea and I guess with all ideas we'll see what happens and what Yoss nationally feel that they want to do with that but potentially it could be.